day six, day six. The puppy has left quite the, uh, the mess for me to clean up this morning. Thankfully, there is some greater being up there because the hair dye that I ordered to fix this is arriving today. It wasn't supposed to arrive until Friday. But first things first, I better clean this mess up. She's letting me know that she wants cuddles, but she's also not happy about the dog being in the room. No, oh, Penny, be nice to your brother. Yeah, boxes of hair dye that I ordered have now arrived, so we can fix whatever the heck is happening on top here. It can't get any worse. Hair dye's all ready, so uh, let's get ready to change all of this. Today in our event calendar, we got another little bath blaster. While my hair is drying, I'm gonna try and make these guys. So it looks like it's just a case of sewing a little triangle with a rounded bottom on it, adding the weights, filling the stuff in, adding some arms, adding the little hat and the little Santa beard. Looks like you might need a hot glue gun for this project as well. Guys ready to see my new hair? <laughs> Not yet. I've still got one more thing that I want to do to my hair before I'm ready for the final reveal. But I do have something to show you guys in the meantime. My little gonks. Look how cute they came out. Oh, they're so sweet. So yeah, I'm just doing a little colour test at the moment with a strand of my hair to make sure that I'm not going to completely ruin all the progress that I've just done. I'm going to finish up doing what I need to do and I'll be back to show you. Are you guys ready to see? <laughs> So I used the dye that arrived earlier today and it turned it into this strawberry blonde colour and then what I did after that was I went in and I took a, um, a brown hair dye, diluted it a little bit and I've gone through my roots, you can see it's a little bit darker around here and underneath. I've also redone my eyebrows so I don't look like a ghost. I'm happy with it for now. I'm not gonna touch it anymore. I've done so much prodding and messing around with it for the last 72 hours. I'm surprised I still have a full head of hair, not gonna lie. But I am just in love with the color. It's so lovely and my hair for all that it's been through isn't that bad. You still see it's got like a nice shine to it. It feels a little bit dry on the ends, but nothing that I haven't really dealt with before. And it's not getting like knotted or tangled when I run my fingers through it, as you can see, so it's not massively damaged. It's just an absolute miracle. But I think we're done messing with the hair. I'm sorry, but I refuse to end another vlog in the kitchen. Tomorrow we are taking the little demon to puppy training classes, which will be interesting. So until the next time, guys, take care. Bye.